one of the exciting things I think Ready for Work also signals is a growing awareness within the industry of the importance of training and formal training and the development of a learning culture and partnerships about that learning that we no longer happy simply to say to a TAFE college, you do the training, but we want to be partners in that training. And Ready for Work is coming from the industry. And it's something the industry says, these are the skills we want people to have in their first few weeks with us, and we want you to recognise them. They might have learnt them on the job, but we might have taught them, but they're real skills and recognise them. How can we work in partnership with you towards getting people with a qualification? So the industry training board has had a strong brief about creating a culture of learning within the, within the industry. Because we've got to move beyond seeing training as a cost to training as a benefit. Now that's been the language, but there's more and more organisations out there that know that that's true. And now I think this represents another step on that pathway. Ready for Work has come about after consultation across the range of um, direct support workers, employers and people with disability. And they've articulated what is their minimum requirements, they believe, in terms of provision of, of a quality service within a safe working environment and a safe environment with people with disabilities. Ready for Work um, package is being developed as part of um, a number of tools under the learning and development strategy. And the strategy states very clearly that it, it is committed to the use of the, um, competencies under the National Training Framework. ACROD Victoria is pleased to uh, be one of the partners involved in DISTIS and consequently in this project uh, Ready for Work. For years we've had organisations that have had to work on their own in recruiting and employing, in orienting staff that come through their doors. Ready for Work is a sector-wide uh, initiative that will assist them uh, to gain competencies across the board, to gain knowledge and experience between themselves and to therefore develop a, a, a more appreciative attitude, not only to people with a disability, but the person's, person with a disability's role in society as a whole, as a citizen of Victoria. When a person enters ready for work and starts their induction and orientation, they in fact are embarking along the pathway of achieving national competencies. And they're doing so through the booklets in the ready for work kit and building on a, a, a career portfolio which will demonstrate their knowledge, their experiences, their competencies and their attitudes to people with disabilities and consequently to people in the whole of the human service sector. It's important to organisations that workers have good induction. Um, and uh, of course, good induction can help to ensure that the burden on each individual agency in the orientation of new staff is reduced. It helps to ensure that as a field, we have an appropriately skilled and professional workforce. And that's something that we all need to be looking to support and facilitate for the future because it's going to be very important in our ongoing capacity to do the work that we do. Look, at the end of the day, Ready for Work is about benefiting everybody. That, that's ultimately what it's about. And in the context of benefit, it also enhances. If we can now embrace Ready for Work, it's only going to enhance that. And that, that would be just excellent for the sector, for, the, for my member organisations, for their staff, for clients, for carers, for, for the community. Ready for Work is an important resource which provides employers with the opportunity to ensure that all their staff have the appropriate knowledge, skills and attitudes to start work in the disability sector. And that also their staff are safe and the people with disability are safe and also that they are receiving quality services from the word go and that um, there is a, a consistent approach to induction by the Victorian disability sector. Employers of course are 
do have to support their workers in a number of ways. We need to provide a safe environment, we need to provide the right training, the right support, the right ongoing development. And one of the key areas of that is about the support we provide to workers before they start on the job. And I think Ready for Work and other induction type programs that provide that training, that support, that consistent message to workers is extremely important. In establishing the Ready for Work training package, it was important to make sure that people with a disability were given the support that was necessary to make them part of a community. We are real people with a need to be part of the community consistently. The Ready for Work training package has been established with collaboration between government and non-government sectors. It has been part of the disability program and people with a disability so that support can be working for them, real people in a real community.